I think when you talk about bringing young people into the community, one of the first things they always are looking for is the cultural aspect. And, and a lot of small towns, the, the perception is that there isn't much to do here. We have a lot of young people here that have come to realize there are things to do here, but there's always a, there's always a desire for more. For my age group and for 20-somethings, I think it provides some good uh, uh, entertainment as well. Probably lacking in quite a few uh, small, I smaller Iowa towns or more rural counties like Greene County is. Young people today with uh, technology and the internet and, uh, can live anywhere they want and very often can live far from where their, where their work center is. So they're going to gravitate to the places that are most attractive to them. Robbie made the decision after he left Greene County to come back to Greene County. But I think the ultimate goal that we could be doing here is to give reasons for people to not leave in the first place. Um, our kids, um, I, you know, they'll leave to be educated, but then to come land back here, there's so many positive things happening in Greene County that give people a reason to stay. Not only for just us, but our family and friends, that we can have something here for them to say, hey, let's go do this together, or let's go to this concert, or whatever it might be, go out to dinner. Um, it will be a nice opportunity to have that here in town. We have a pretty broad range of age of employees at our workforce, but uh, realizing the future of the company is going to be based upon the younger generation being here. And in fact, having two young daughters, I take a lot of input from them on they like to have things to do in the community and see a thriving community. He has been in the telephone industry and he's the fifth generation. And just to have that opportunity for our son or daughter, if they wanted to go into the telephone industry, that they would have that opportunity here in Jefferson as well. And seeing some of the progressiveness of the community along with the casino uh, makes me think that this is a good fit and will help residents want to stay in the area. People that had come back, which is really what struck me, was trying to get people my age back into our community and we have to have a place for them to work. I think that our small town community is a well-kept secret from either coast. We've got people coming back, living in Greene County with the internet access that we have. And I think the casino is just one more thing that will make our small town quality of life that much better.